This is Prowl 1701, and we're here to do a review on the Ultra Saber's Dark Sentinel V4. This is my first V4 Saber. That's a new line they've just released. Um, the Dark Sentinel's pretty sharp. I uh, bought it as I was I was entering a raffle that they do every now and then. They, they do a raffle. I was entering that, so this was part of my raffle entry. I uh, really like the pommel here. It has a little more substance than some of the pommels. Has these little uh, ringed ridges right here, which are. I was kind of concerned with how these would be to hold, but it's actually very comfortable. Uh, has these two little narrow points here, similar to the prophecy, which is kind of what first drew me to the saber, as I'm a big fan of the prophecies, of the prophecy hilts. And I got a standard AV switch right here. It's a stunt saber, so no sound, and those those come with a standard switch. And got the emitter here. Kind of a basic emitter, but I like it. Uh, this one has windows on it right here, these nice horizontal windows. You can actually get this emitter with or without windows. I wanted it with the windows. It's in violet amethyst. Um, not a color I have a lot of. I have a couple of dark violet amethyst sabers, but the only violet amethyst I had was my manticore. So I decided to get another one. You can see how the light kind of goes through the windows there. Pretty sharp looking. But I'm impressed with the Saber. I like it. It's um, really well designed. Give it kind of a horizontal look at it here. I think they did a really good job with it. I'm enjoying the new V4 line. Most of the V4 Sabers not only can you equip with a soundboard, but also the Emerald Driver, where the V3, some of the some of the V3s can only do one or the other. Oh, go ahead and hand the phone off here to my cameraman. Um, it's a smaller Saber, which I tend to like. I'm a small guy I'm five six weigh about 130 pounds some of the bigger sabers are hard for me to wield for long periods of time so this uh this is about the right size for me it's very light it's easy for me to swing around and practice with I'm trying to make sure i don't hit the fan which i will do there we go we'll cut it on give you a look at it it's uh very bright you can see it illuminates really well and I, I like stunt sabers sometimes uh, for exercising. A lot of times I'm actually out exercising, swinging it around in the yard or something. I prefer a stunt saber. Kind of get lost in the exercise. You can see the windows right here. This light shining through. I'm impressed with it. Like I said, it's my first V4 hilt. And i got to say I like it. Uh, the violet amethyst goes really well with the black sentinel hilt. The dark sentinel hilt. So, um, I like it. I uh, wasn't sure what I was going to think of it, but I'm pretty impressed with it. It's a great saber. Uh, really solid, really solid hilt. Really comfortable. And the, uh, the black on it looks really sharp. Um, different kind of from the, some of the other sabers. I don't know if it's anodized that way, if it was actually originally black metal, but it, it looks and feels a little different than some of the other, uh, black sabers I have from them. And I actually like it better. Look at it again. It's since this is a stunt saber, it only has the standard setup, which is four AAA batteries. You just unscrew the pommel. Oh, be careful not to do what I just did. So you have a Velcro strip and then four AAA batteries. The Velcro strip just kind of helps keep it from rattling around and making as much noise. And you just put it right back in. Yeah, be careful not to do that. You don't want to damage your wires. And then the pommel screws in. The pommel's interchangeable with pommels from other sabers. Uh, they have a modular system. The uh, emitter is not removable like it is on some sabers. It's actually part of the saber. But this is the um, the Dark Sentinel V4 and in violet amethyst. I'm pretty impressed with it. I like it. Uh, kind of reminds me of the prophecies a little bit and how it feels, how it holds. And I'm Prowl 1701 and Thank you for watching.